The Gleipnir is now positioned above Terminus Island. It is using the island as a resupply base and as a staging point for long-range attacks on Stand Canyon. The troops stranded at Stand Canyon are vital to the upcoming assault on Santa Elva. But they're pinned down as long as the Gleipnir's assault is allowed to continue. Something must be done about the situation and soon. Analysis of the SWBM attack at Cape Aubrey has shown that the shock wave of the missile dissipates before reaching ground level. Hoping to utilize this weakness, the remaining Aurelian fleet has gathered for a counter-assault on the airborne fortress. We have been informed that the assault will begin as soon as we are ready. How shall we proceed, sir? Put 
back. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Impact. We've succeeded in destroying the Gleipnir's SWBM. The surrounding area is no longer in any danger. Unfortunately, the Gleipnir escaped, but this victory has given us hope. I'm starting to feel like retaking Santa Elva is fastly becoming a reality. We have an emergency situation. The Miller unit has moved from Kings Hill for an assault on Fort Patterson. They reclaim the city almost immediately. We've also confirmed the transport of supplies from the fort to Santa Elva via Kings Hill. I had no idea this was in their plan. Uh, sorry about that. On with the update. The Gleipnir has withdrawn from the combat zone and is now in Santa Elva. Furthermore, with the destruction of the Gleipnir's SWBM, Long-range assaults are no longer a threat.